Welcome back. This is episode four of Silkscreen Bobby TV, where Biden sucks 24-7, and that never changes. But enough about that. We have a really good show for you tonight. But first off, let me just thank everyone for their support and their comments regarding episode three, which was the Silkscreen Rodney. And it was a real throwback to the Johnny Carson and Rodney Dangerfield days. And for those of you who enjoyed it, I'm really glad you did. It was fun to make. But for today, we have another throwback. This goes back to the early days of rap and the Sugar Hill Gang. And the very first rap song called Rapper's Delight, which I decided to have a little fun with here. And it's a tribute to the early days of rap and really a tribute to just how much Joe Biden sucks. So enjoy. To the boogie beat, I got a rhythm that you need to know. Cause there's a creepy old guy on Pennsylvania Street. I'm talking about a man named Joe. He's a career politician, a man on a mission, and a crime family on the take. He don't care about inflation, crime, or immigration, only care about the money he makes. Joe climbing up a flight of stairs But it's a real adventure for a man With dementia and a mind that is unawares Now he's a shell of a man Who was never much Even in his younger years He's just an old Pied Piper With a loaded dirty diaper And he tell them what they needs to hear Check it out A younger brother and a son named Hunter Selling influence all over the world And for all their troubles They get lots of rubles And a fair amount of Chinese girls Hunter made a life with his brother's wife Living off his daddy's name but the drugs and the females and the laptop emails Maybe gonna end his game <laughs> And while immigration attacks the nation Joe's laughing at the southern border Well, what do you expect from a Democrat? No respect for law and order In Afghanistan, Joe had no plan He just needed to cut and run but when the smoke cleared and the lives so dear, we lost our daughters and sons. Well, there's stumbling Joe and there's mumbling Joe, his eyes open in an empty stare. He's in the past, thinking when's the last time I sniffed a young girl's hair. And Joe has an eye for the youngest girls, younger than you may know. And it might surprise you if I told you about the lens he is willing to go. Yeah, it's a well-known issue for some time that the family hoped you'd miss. But his own granddaughter right in front of her father and he gave her just a little kiss like this. Well, there's Fauci, Cuomo, and CNN. They spewing all the lies they make. There's Schumer, Pelosi, and AOC. Criminals on the take. Kamala, Obama, and Hillary, they all in on the game. Plus the girl replacing Jen Psaki, ain't nobody know her name. So here we go to the ballot box, it's 2024. You sit and wonder about election fraud, but we know there'll be even more. A fixed election is what they plan, it explains all the laws they wrote. Illegals and dead Democrats, they'll all have the right to vote. So if they win and get four more years by cheating to the core, then rest assured it's got to happen. We're going to have a civil war.